Hello. This is Psychic Treasures Unlimited here to talk to you today about the upcoming general astrological energies of a very dynamic August, beginning with Mercury retrograde and the new moon in Leo occurring on August 4th during the powerful Lion's Gate portal. This will likely be a month of wild cards, sudden changes, shocking surprises, insights, and lots of creative juices flowing. This month will ask us to find our patience and to remain level-headed and flexible as we will feel things shifting quickly, especially during the latter half of the month. July 26th until August 12th brings us the Lion's Gate portal. When the Earth, the Sun, Orion's Belt, and the star Sirius, known as the Dog Star, are aligned in the sky. This is why this time is referred to as the Dog Days of Summer. This is a time for healing, spiritual downloads, and manifestations a very fortuitous energy, energized even more by the strong solar flares and so much light entering our planet right now. Mercury retrograde will begin in Virgo on August 4th or 5th, depending on where you are in the world, and last until August 28th. But there is always a shadow period a few days before and a few days after the official dates so you may already be feeling the effects of this Mercury retrograde. As we always say, buckle up and ride with it. Double check details, review particulars, schedules, and logistics at this time. Virgo is very detail oriented and connected to service. Your orders could be screwed up, your packages delayed, things like that. Psychic Treasures Unlimited is here to help support you during Mercury Retrograde with spiritual mentor sessions, calming meditation, chakra remedies to balance your energy centers, and soothing relaxation with our Reiki practitioner. August 2nd brings us a square between Venus and Uranus, which could lead to fluctuations in currencies, this energy combined with Mars in Gemini makes us want to shift things in our lives. We may feel a push to just turn everything upside down. This strong Venus energy especially applies to the fixed signs of Taurus, Leo, Scorpio, and Aquarius. Just know that this feeling should pass, so don't make any abrupt decisions in the first few days of August when these energies abound. The new moon occurring in Leo on August 4th at 7.13 a.m. here on the East Coast is always a time to light a candle, set your intentions, and plant new seeds to grow with the moon's cycle. If you need a brush up Zoom session on how to manifest with all of the tips and tricks channeled by our spirit guides, just reach out to us to schedule an appointment. Leo is confident, social, dramatic, creative, big and bold. Leo is a natural leader and a sovereign being, a fire sign that is willing to take risks and go for it. This is a great time to focus on and launch creative projects and step into your own power rather than being led by arguments on social media, by the news, by political leaders, by whatever social norms of the day abound, etc. Leo drives an overall desire to be independent. There is a strong astrological push right now, despite what we are being fed constantly by the fear porn programming of the external world, to embrace sovereignty and especially love over fear. Just after this new moon, adrenaline-filled Mars will conjunct expansive Jupiter in Gemini. This energy will be speeding things up a great deal 
events will seem to be happening very quickly. This will be a good time for enterprise, sales, and personal expression, essentially talking your way into anything you want as Gemini is connected to the throat chakra, communication. This will be supported by the Leo new moon trining the north node of destiny. If you are ready to launch new creative ideas or projects, now is the time and opportunities will support you. Gemini is linked to communication and Jupiter is about finding the truth. So expect a lot of energy and information pouring out of news outlets and social media at this time. As always, we recommend staying out of the fray and above the splintering duality. Remember to stay level-headed rather than polarized. United we stand, divided we fall. Jupiter in Gemini is then going to square Saturn in Pisces, which will encourage us to stay flexible and go with the flow, especially in the latter part of August. This will feel like a contradictory energy to the full steam ahead mindset of this new moon. Jupiter is not at its best in Gemini. Gossip is out of control. There tends to be misinformation and a lot of over-exaggeration. This miscommunication is exacerbated by the Mercury retrograde. So we would encourage you to do your best not to be overly opinionated or polarizing at this time. Gemini always provides two sides to every story, but the square to Saturn leads people to dig their heels in and to be overall less compassionate. Neptune is retrograde at the anorectic or crisis degree of Pisces which presents a lot of murkiness regarding what is true and what is not. Things may tend to be confusing at this time and the truth is rather elusive, as we are seeing out there in the collective. Pluto in Aquarius asks us to surrender. Learn the lessons we are being shown. Look to the future and ask ourselves what we really want in order to transition into a higher version of ourselves. Connect to your light, which brings me to Namaste. The soul light within me honors the soul light within you. Look to the light rather than the darkness as we move through this shift. Happy weekend from Psychic Treasures Unlimited and happy new moon in Leo.